Hey Tubers, <clears throat> Saint Enix here. We are doing another quick video. I might be doing a couple of these today. Oop, I did not mean to punch the air. Or butt whip the air, pistol, you know, hit it with the thing and the stuff. Okay, so anyway, this video is going to be about equipping your followers slash settlers slash companions slash people that help you do shit. Um... <laughs> yeah, strong. We know. So, th this is strong. The super mutant companion you can get in the game. And he's just decked out in super mutant gear that I've picked up. Oh, wow. What is all this stuff? I forgot I even put that in there. Wow, that's cool. So, anyway. So, what you do is you, you go... Strong. <laughs> I like strong. You go into trade. It doesn't matter if it's a settler or a companion. Um, as long as you can trade with them, you can swap things out. So, he's got all this stuff. I'll, I pretty much just hand him, like, all my super mutant stuff. Because he's the only super mutant. Who else am I going to put it on? But uh, then, once it's in their inventory, you can go to any item. Right? Let's do the aviator cap. Watch his head. You hit T, as it says down there in the bottom, it says T, equip. Boom. It's that simple. They made it really, really easy. It works super well. I mean, it just, it just works. Um, oh, I took that. I didn't mean to take that. I went to T, not E. I got lots of stuff. Yeah, as you guys can see, I mod my carry weight like hell, because I don't... It's retarded that I have to, like fast travel three times from a location to run back all the stuff. It just doesn't make any sense. Besides, I shouldn't have to sit through all that. I should be able to just, uh... I should honestly be able to call settlers in and have them collect everything in an area, but I figure the way I do it makes up for that. So, that's just, that's that's all it is. That's how simple it is. You can also... Also... Watch this. Heads up. Hey, Garvey. I got him command... I, I, I pressed E while I faced him and got the command window thing, right? He's gonna go get in the fucking power armor. All you have to do is select him... Aw. It's too far back. Okay, well, how about the X01 here? Or the the Brotherhood one right here. Oh, no, not that one. Ah, We'll do it. We'll get it. We'll, yeah. I got them tight. I got them too tight. They have to have room enough to get around behind it. We'll try that one. Can you get to that one? Oh, you suck, Garvey. Where did you go? Alright, well, we're just going to do this one then. Garvey, you better not glitch out on me, dude. Oh, he's stuck. Apparently, that chair is not going to work there. Come on, Garvey. Okay, so let's try this one more time. Heads up. Get in the motherfucking power armor. What? Oh, so he's stuck Move now. Here. You just... You stupid bastard. Look alive. Okay. What am I doing? Humans are look funny. Look alive. Okay. Here. Oh, Garvey. You are gonna make me so angry. Alright, we're gonna store the recruiting table. And we'll just have him do it at the... At the desk, and we'll put some storage here. We gotta get this guy out of this damn corner. Whoa! Okay, so now he glitched out. What the fuck, Garvey? He's just he's just hopping all over the place now. Now that's cool. That's that's awesome. God. 
You know what? Screw you, Garvey. You can stay here. Where's Kate? Kate will get in the damn power armor. Hey, baby. How you doing? Always. Always with you. Let's go. Okay, so we gotta send him to there. Let's leave him here. Maybe he'll figure himself out. Come on, Kate. Let's go show these folks how you can get into a power armor suit. Come on, honey. I've already started flirting with her. I don't know, there's something about redhead, Irish accent. Just makes me go all weak in the knees. Come on. Come on, Kate. Get your ass in the fucking power armor. Yes! Do it! Watch. This is so cool. No, don't run at the front of it. What the... F Kate. Okay, so the pathfinding is a little bit funky. But... There we go. There we go. <gasps> My sexy Irish lady. In power armor. Oh, Kate. Oh, baby. And it's BOS power armor, too. Brotherhood of Steel. Yeah. So you can have her follow you around. Then you can tell her to get out of it. Head over there. Oh, wait. Shit. Okay. No, what you gotta do... Okay. <clears throat> you talk to her. You get up to talk to her. You go to talk. Hey there. And then exit power armor. Instead of uh, the relationship one, you'll get exit power armor. So you can make her get out when you need it. Jump in yourself, go through the radiation, or jump off a building, or kill the raiders, or whatever. Then get back out of it. Let her use it to keep her alive. It's really, really cool. I like the feature. Uh, sorry, sorry about all the shadows. Um, I'm playing this on something that's literally like 70% of recommended specs. Like my GPU, my graphics card is like two generations older than the one they want you to use. They recommend like a 7,000 series. I got like a high-end 5,000 series. <clears throat> they recommend like a 3.2 quad, and I've got like a 2.8. You know, so yeah. But uh, there you go, folks. You can you can equip your followers. You can make them wear power armor. You can command them to get out of the power armor. You and use it yourself. Put them back in it. It's just awesome. And now I'm just like amassing a crew of just some heavy hitting motherfuckers. I can't wait for the the creation kit to come out so that we can do an unlimited companions mod and have like 12 motherfuckers walking behind us in power armor that'd be beast but uh yeah so stay tuned folks and r drop a comment hit the like button subscribe if you'd like to see more but definitely comment if there's anything you guys are stumped on or i've already spent like almost 72 hours in this game since the 10th okay i've i've gone nuts on this game since then and and a lot, and some of that time was just testing to make sure it could work properly and messing with the configuration files. If you've got a computer that's just not running it very well, I can probably email you over the copies of my config files. It would look like this, and the shadows would be all junky, but it might go from being 10 FPS to 25 or 30. It might be playable then. Um, just always be on the lookout. Whenever a song is about to end, when an asset streams the next song, or especially the the high bitrate audio from the DJ or the guy that uh, for Radio Freedom that says, you know, all clear or so-and-so needs help, remember, right before a song ends, when it starts asset streaming that, it's going to take a hit. So if you're in combat or getting ready to go in combat, damn, Kate, you got some red-ass eyes. You been drinking? You been smoking? You better be sharing, bitch. Anyway. So, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting all sidetracked. This has been St. Enix coming to you from the Commonwealth at the Red Rocket Minutemen Recruiting Station, just south of Sanctuary Hills. 
with my main squeeze Kate. Mm-hmm. Yeah, baby. Ooh, you sexy. Heads up. Sure, sure. Can I help? <laughs> let's see, let's check it out. Check in. See how you feel things are going between us. You and me versus the Commonwealth. Yeah. I'd say those are damn good odds in our favor. Me and you, baby. Me and you. Nothing else I needed. Sure. So Yep. This is Saint Saint Enix. Take it easy, everybody.